the the song and stuff like that. But that would go to Barbie probably because the best the the song the songs in Barbie by the way. I'm just kidding. Yes, yes, I'm just kidding. And so it likes to be a friend. You know that kind of song. Yeah. Oh my god! Freaking Ryan Reynolds did a was that Ryan Gosling did an Ryan amazing. Gosling. Ryan Gosling did an amazing job as. <laughs> oh my god, he's an amazing Ken. Oh my god. Yeah, like Barbie was pretty fun to watch as well. Um, I especially liked the uh, theme of like, you know, empowering women. But, you know, you get to see the other side and, you know, you got to feel bad for the Kens. The Kens were treated like garbage. They were. I mean, the thing is like people care about Barbies more than Kens. But then again, it's like the the whole thing about Barbie land is supposed to be a women world, you know, not really yeah. dominant by men. Which made sense when, in the end, when like Ken got influenced by so many like manly things happening in the real world, he came yeah. back to Barbie Land, became and wanted to make a Ken Land now or something like that. I was like, holy shit! <laughs> There's like so many like manly things. It's something about horses and things like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude! I was just I, I didn't expect Greta Gertwig to actually make a film like that. Like. It's great to see that it's supposed to be about empowering women and things like that, which is a great like reflection of like what Barbie is, what the Barbie movie looks like. Um, that Barbie could be anything. Barbie could be like you know a nurse, a baseball player, uh, you know anything in business, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But yeah, I must just like shock the. Well, I mean that was the point of the movie, which was great. But then you also get to see like all the funny bits that also happened in the movie as well, like Alan. Yes, <laughs> Alan is best character. I stand Alan. Like, like honestly, like some people are Team Barbie, some people are Team Ken. I'm just like I'm Team Alan. Oh Let's yeah, Al, Alan's just there. Alan's just there. <laughs> like he's like he's the only Alan there. He's like the single odd man out, and I just love him. <laughs> I'm just like, oh yeah, Alan's just there. He's just a random guy. <laughs> but I, I don't know what, but I feel like everybody in that movie definitely did an amazing job. Margot Robbie, perfect Barbie. Um, we got to see Ryan Gosling. He's an amazing Ken. Ken, Simi Liu, who was in the movie, he was a great Ken as well. <laughs> oh, even the CEO, uh, Will Ferrell, he was. I don't know. Will Ferrell was pretty. How it was going on with Will Ferrell, but he likes to rule over toys. You know, he was in the Lego movie. Now he's in Barbie. Yeah, he was pretty funny as the uh, CEO of. Oh uh, yeah, that's right. The CEO yeah, of uh, CEO of Barbie. Dude, that one line from that one girl though. Something about a fascist. I was like, yeah. <laughs> what? They they had but then that. we put that in a Barbie movie. I'm like, how? <laughs> What I also like about Barbie is that it tackles existential crisis. Yeah. Like, you see Barbie um, trying to, like, question, like, where her purpose and all that. Yeah. And that theme carries through all the way to the movie. It was just like, oh, my God. I, I don't know. You never expected, like, these this things out of all places come out for this Barbie movie. So I was surprised overall. I was, like, amazed, happy with everything. Dude, John Cena was in the movie too. Come on now. <laughs> yeah, John Cena was a Ken also. Yeah, I was like, what the fuck is going he was, on here? He was Aqua Ken. It was, great. It was straight was... up. No, it was straight up ridiculous, but it was in a great, ridiculous, funny way. Um, I thought it was a really fun movie overall. Barbie, I mean, this great. I mean, not gonna lie, like the weekend, no doubt, was just amazing. But Barbie was a op, was on top film as well. Maybe like nine out of ten top film versus like the ten out of ten Oppenheimer. But I have to say this though, Barbie definitely was an entertaining film, and I really was enjoying every single second of like what Barbie was. And I know it's gonna be on Max soon, so I have to watch it there. But yeah, <laughs> um, it was. I don't know what they were planning with Barbieheimer, but both movies came out in the same weekend, and both movies succeeded because we now know Barbie is currently like the top grossing movie right now this year. Um, and then you also get to see uh, Oppenheimer is also being like a top, you know, grossing movie as well. It did outbeat Mario Brothers movie, by the way. So <laughs> <laughs> nothing against the Mario movie. I give it an eight out of ten. But yeah, when I heard it beat Mario, I Dude, felt defeated. Everybody, I, I felt so defeated, man. Everybody grew up with Barbie too, so you're facing off with Mario versus Barbie. I'm like. A lot, a lot of people play video games. People play with doll. Girls play with dolls. So I would imagine girls out of all places. Meanwhile, would, boys play video games. Yeah, so. boys play video games and they play, watch the Mario Brothers movie. Well, all the girls were watching Barbie. And I, I watched Barbie. Heck, I, I wanted to check it out myself. <laughs> and in the end, it turned out to be a really good movie. <laughs> yeah, like, like, but I was going to say GG Barbie, but uh, you shouldn't have been the iconic plumber, though. Oh, really? Really? I, I think it deserved it, to be fair. <laughs> Really, I think it deserved it. Yeah. Okay, Pink Boy. I I would say much much. I would say it was um much better than Mario movie. I'm sorry. 
Yeah, to be expected from a guy who wears a pink shirt. I mean, I mean, <laughs> I did say, I did praise the fact that the Bar- Barbie movie was great. I could have watched it like two or three more times, but you watched your Mario movie like ten times or something like that. Um, make it five times in theaters and then like three times at home. Nonetheless, it still like outbeats. I don't know. This guy watched way too much Mario movies, and I watched Barbie, and I thought Barbie was way better than Mario movie to me. <laughs> hey, to each their own, I guess. To right? each their own, but I know that you're going to probably be like, Nate, why are you not picking Mario? <laughs> why, not, why not this team? Nah. Hey, all, all your Mario fans, comment below. You can't beat Greta Gertwig. <laughs> She's a great director. <laughs> and you can't beat Jack Black as Bowser. Okay, okay, still, but they have their moments, but overall of a movie, definitely Barbie beats it for sure. Hey, I mean, like, hey, um, that's Kenuff for now. <laughs> We're all Kenuff. Yes, yeah. yes, Kenuff. <laughs> We're all Kenuff. <laughs> no, I should get that. I should get that sweatshirt. I'm, I'm Kenuff or something like that. <laughs> I'm Kenuff too. Like we all, we're all Kenuff here. <laughs> oh my God! It, it, you can, you can buy it on the Mar- You can buy it at the Mattel store, by the way. You can oh, buy nice. that sweatshirt at the Mattel store. <laughs> yeah, they got like Barbie movie merchandise. I know, I know. I really do want to get out that thing. <laughs> But yeah, actually, like unlike most others, I didn't see Barbie and Oppenheimer the same day. I oh, actually saw on different oh, days. Oh, really? You were in the same weekend? We both did a double feature. I did a double feature on one day. To yeah, watch I did Barbie do double feature. I did see both movies um, on the same uh, on the same weekend. Well, nonetheless, I mean, they'll both be good movies, and hopefully, they both get to the Oscars. I would. It, it'd be funny if Barbie does make it to the Best Picture Oscar, and I'm like, no, 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 no. I know Oppenheimer's gonna win it. <laughs> Hands down. But but I just hope Barbie actually does make some Oscar wins. Maybe best song. For, oh, for oh, I'm just Ken. I'm pretty sure they would best song for Come for someone who could sing Peaches all day. I love Peaches, uh, but I'm just that's Ken. That's right. Though. Every, everybody's just like going for Jack Black's uh, Peaches, but then. The reason why I'm, I'm just, just Ken, Ken is good. <laughs> I'm just Ken is a good song. Now, see, the reason why I'm just Ken has a you know higher chance of winning over Peaches is because I'm just Ken is much longer. Yeah. Whereas Peaches is more sh- shorter much is shorter yeah so. I, nonetheless i mean hopefully both end up doing great job doing a great job in the Oscars. Yeah.